Hi, Pastor Charlie here from New Hope Lutheran Church with another edition of Pastor Charlie's Toolbox. You know, working on a vehicle or almost anything out here in the garage is, it's uplifting. You get to do something, you get to fix something, you get to make it better. Except, except when, when things you find are really, really broken. Yeah, this one is not going to live to see another day. And it's disappointing to see this, this kind of carnage, especially in a vehicle. We probably don't want to hear about it. And please, please, don't tell me how much it's going to cost me because that's just way too disappointing. It's painful. But Good Friday, Good Friday brings out similar feelings for us too. The lesson for today found in John chapters 18 and 19, and that's chapters 18 and 19, not just a couple of verses. Uh, it's a lot of reading. And if you're not one who likes to read, that can be painful too, I'm sure. But the whole story of Good Friday is very painful. We read about Jesus' arrest, which wasn't very pretty. We read about the trial, which was kind of a sham. No justice there at all. There was torture involved including really severe beatings. And then, to top it all off, Jesus was put to death in one of the most inhumane ways that humans have ever found. A way that took hours and hours for him to die. We need to hear about this, though. As much as it's painful, it's hard to take, we need to hear about it because well, if we didn't go through the, the pain of fixing something like a vehicle, for instance, after a while, it's not going to be of any use to us at all. At all. It's going to be nothing more than a prop. See, someone has to pay the price to fix or repair something like this. And the same goes for our sins. In the past season of Lent, we've been encouraged to look inside of ourselves, to figure out where we're broken inside, to figure out where, where we need repairs, and also to think about what's the cost going to be. Because others I've probably been hurt by things we, we've said or we've done. We may have even injured ourselves by something we've said or done, whether we meant it or not. But the good news is that even though there's a price to pay for that, on Good Friday, we're reminded that that payment was made. And when you look at it that way, the, the gore, the horrible things that happen on Good Friday, it's actually good news for us because we find out that somebody else paid the price for our mistakes, for our sins. And today we're reminded that the cost we've incurred and the price that's fast to be paid it's already been paid on our behalf. You see, there's a reason we call this Good Friday. We'll see you again.